Okay, so as you might remember, I made this drill out of two buckets and it's coming up to temp now. Uh, and what I do have is I have this 12 inch grate from the small grill. And to that I've uh, added two steel wires and I bought this uh, old plate uh, at a flea market. It only cost me a buck. And I'm just going to cover that with some, some foil. Let's just keep the soot away from it because it turns really, really black. And it will also catch a little bit of dripping. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that in here. And then I'm going to fasten this wire. Got an extra piece of wire. I'm just going to hook that over here. And might have to put that together. I want to be able to get it loose. I think that's going to hang perfectly under there. So that should go into the grill. This is almost hashed over. But I'm going to leave it for a little bit before I start cooking. Anyway, so this is going to fit on here. And I will have about a quarter inch, maybe a little bit more around the plate that will let the heat up here. I think this is going to work really well. But I'm going to let this burn a few minutes and then it's time to put the chicken. go. I've got two pieces of plum wood on there. And time to put the grate on here. I've just got these drumsticks. They're seasoned with the uh, It's Incredible by Heaven Made Products. It goes really, really well with chicken. I know you've heard that before. We need to get a probe in there. This is just for the pit. I'm gonna run this until they look done. I'm probably not gonna be able not to look. There we go. So top on, top vent open. So I've got three vent holes up top and two vents in the bottom. One is uh, at the same level as the charcoal and one is below and I've got a little bucket with holes in it underneath. But if you're interested you could check out my video on when I built this. I'll link to it up in that corner or that corner. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna leave this for a minute or two and then we'll see what temp it settles in at. Uh, I'm gonna go as high as it gets. It's been about 15 minutes and it's um, more or less steady at 350 which is perfect for chicken I think. And the smoke is bluish. Well, I'm happy with it so far. I haven't looked. I don't know what it looks like inside, but it is what it is. See you in a bit. Okay, so it's been about half an hour. I'm gonna have a look at this. Yeah, They're looking really nice. I'm gonna flip them over. I'm gonna move them around as well, I think. It's probably a little bit warmer towards the edges so maybe I should put them like that. Pretty hot over there. There's a vent down there so maybe that makes it burn hotter. Well there we go. Back with the lid. See you in a bit. Okay so it's been one hour. I'm gonna attempt this. 185, 190, just the way I want them. Just gonna take these off and bring them inside. There we go, last made for this trip to the getaway. Some chicken drumsticks. Hmm. Very tasty, usually is. Um, heaven made products. It's incredible. It's really good um, It's got a nice smoke ring. I'm not gonna take a picture where I took a bite and uh, the felt plate worked really well I'm happy with the result of this. Thank you for watching. Bye